Okay, so hello everyone. I am here to share with you all about Cephi. So Cephi is a module inside of the AO app and it's really, really an amazing tool uh, using frequencies. And so without any delay, let's go ahead and get started, okay? First and foremost, I'm gonna share with you my screen. Okay. Okay. So in your welcome email, one of the options is to click on your back office. And once you click on your back office and you can log in, then if you go here to the left-hand side of where the menu is and you go to training, and then you click on training courses. That's where you'll have all the training courses listed and you'll see Solex University. When you click on Solex University, this will give you the option of your basic training. Basic training is where you will see the module for Cephi. That's one way of finding that information. And another way to find the information is if you go to the Solex main website, which is solexglobal.com, and you click on blog, and then you will have several blogs that you can go through. One of them will say, how to make your own custom playlists in Cephi. So you can click on that, and here you go it shares with you that information. So before I get into my personal details using Cephi, I'm gonna actually play this video so then you can see from Lauren himself all about Cephi. We're gonna talk about Cephi. This is the fourth module of the AOSCAN system and Cephi stands for Subtle Energy Frequency Imprinter. Now, before we get too much into this, I'd like to remind you to go back up to the top of your screen. And on my screen, it's a little blue dot with a question mark on it. And if you're on a different theme, it might be a different color, but it's always up in the top right corner and has a little question mark. And when you click on that, it gives you information about this module. And at the bottom, there will be a video. And that video in, in Cephi is so, so valuable. Watch this video, it's short, but it goes through everything that you need to see and understand about the Cephi. It's just an amazing thing. So when you click on Cephi, that module, your, your menu comes up. And like I said, there's your, your information and your video. Watch that video, because that's gonna help you so much understand this. Okay, so Cephi. Now Cephi is a module that will always be expanding. And so you're gonna see things on this screen. And by the time you watch this video, there may be other things on this screen. Or maybe you started when there weren't as many things. Cephi is always expanding, just like Vitals and Inner Voice and Comprehensive. We're always expanding and enhancing that technology as we can, as technology allows. Cephi is one of those where you'll see changes more often. Now in the video, it talked about most of these on here, so I'm not gonna go through all of those. But if you'll notice at the very top, well, actually, I'm gonna be for that, at the very top where it says target, that's really critical in Cephi. Now it's critical on all the others, but when you're doing imprinting and especially broadcasting, the target is critical. Now, if it's just, you're just dealing with yourself, you're just gonna to wanna to make sure that your target is the same uh, picture is what's up in the top profile. And if it's not, if it's a pet or if it's a client, you want to make sure that you've changed that target to the appropriate one. Because in Cephi, everything that happens in Cephi goes to the target, not to the top profile. That's really important to know. Target is critical. So if it's you, just make sure you and the target are the same. Right below that, you have erase and imprint, and the video goes through that and explains that to you. Um, but right below that is custom playlist. Now, custom playlist, um, this is where you can go through through those different uh, 
sections in Cephi and select different things like you might in this case here as you see this is a playlist that we called abundance and it has abundance abundance wealth and success gratitude successful success and immune support all those were put together and made into this playlist so if I want to play it again, I don't have to go back and select all of those. I made that playlist. If you'll notice, if I click in that box, here's all the different playlists that I've created on this on uh, in my Cephi. And I can go through and just pick that one and it will load the the playlist that I or the uh, frequencies that I wanted to play in that list. Playlist is incredibly uh an incredible time saver for you when you're dealing with yourself or with uh, with a client because once that playlist is done you just literally can play it and not have to go through and put it all together again playlist is probably one of the most popular parts of Cephi because people are able to use it so quickly and so often you can edit it by just hitting the edit button allow you to go in and erase and delete and then add new ones to it it's really simple and it's pretty self-explanatory as you go to play with it to go back out of that, go back into your Cephi. All of these others, the video is already that you've watched has already showed you these. The other one that I want to show to uh, show you here that you may not have seen or heard before is quantum homeopathics. This one is phenomenal. If you are new to homeopathics or you're a veteran, you're going to love this program. It makes it so simple. Homeopathy has been around for 200 years, and there's lots of controversy about it. If you go to the medical establishment, they're going to tell you it's bogus. If you talk to naturopathists, they're going to tell you it's, it's the greatest thing since sliced bread. Homeopathy, you're going to find your own belief in homeopathy by just working with it. The beauty of, of the homeopathy section in the Cephi is the work that it does for you. For example, let's say that you have a sore throat. Well, you can go over here to this, this blue bar at the top and hit by symptom. And you click in that box, that white box, and here's all these different symptoms. And you can find the symptom that relates to you. And in, in this case, we said sore throat. So let's go down to sore throat. And once we've uh, selected that, we select that. Sore throat goes up in there. It loads the homeopathic frequencies or homeopathic remedies that are recommended for that particular condition. Now, here's where it gets even more exciting. There's four of them. So how do I know which one's the best for me? Because they're all good for sore throat. Well, if you look right below that, there's a little button that says scan. And if I click scan, it will now take a quick scan of me and say, okay, out of these four, that is what you see on the screen here. It rearranged those four, the top one being the most beneficial for me at this moment in time. Now for me, I would imprint all of those. But if I just needed to do one or just wanted to do one, I now know which one. That's by symptom. That's it just takes all the guesswork out. It makes it so easy to do. Now, if you're a seasoned homeopathic practitioner, you can just click on homeopathics and click on there. And there's over 600 of the most commonly used homeopathic remedies already there. And all you have to do is click on the one you want, put your, uh, your sugar or sucrose pellets down there on the screen or your ring or your water, your tincture, erase it and then imprint it. That's probably one of my favorite parts of, of Cephi is the ability to make homeopathic frequency remedies right here on the device. So play with Cephi. Get in there. Just take some time. Take some time just like you would with, a you know, if you were going to learn a new hobby. Take the time uh, to learn how to use these different modules. And Cephi is amazing that way. Now, the last thing I want to talk about is Cephi Dots. You click on Cephi Dots. Now, we have the little uh, foil silicon dots that you can purchase and you can put them on your, uh, on your body. Well, what makes this nice is you can do a scan on yourself, and I'll just do one for me real quick. And it will come up with, right now, one of the uh, 
energetic balance is out of range for me right now, according to this. And it will say, okay, this is the Cephe dot that I would use. And it shows me where I would put those dots on my body. Once I've found that, I can just then take a Cephe dot, put it down on the screen, erase it, then imprint it, and then put it on my body. Um, and if I say, well, I don't really feel like I've got an energetic imbalance, I can click that and pick one of the other ones. Cephe dots is just another one of those tools in your arsenal of things to work with. Learn it, use it, and share it. Okay, so that was a nice summary by Lauren himself. So let's do a deeper dive. And I'll show you from my app here. We're going to go, here's a home page, the home app right page. Right down here where we see Cephi. And remember, Cephi stands for subtle energy frequency imprinter. Anytime you have a question on any part of these modules, you can go right up here to the upper right hand corner and click on the question mark. The question mark is an awesome tool. So it'll when you click on it, you'll be able to see the same exact instructions that you heard about from basic training. And it'll help you to just, again, answer something that you may have forgotten or just it's a great reference. So on anything, any part of the app, always go to that question mark and it'll give you some insight. And then over to the left-hand side, always remember this is the home button. So if you ever need to go back to home, that's the button right there, the icon, the AO scan infinity. Um, that's the icon that you click in order to go home. So once again, we're gonna go back down to Cephi. So I'm gonna show you first and foremost, because Cephi stands for Subtle Energy Frequency Imprinter, it means that all you can imprint frequencies on imprintable items. Before you imprint anything, it's very important to make sure you erase any frequencies that are, that are on an imprintable item, okay? So then you kind of start with a clean slate with an imprintable item. So whether it's a, a Cephi dot, have it here. Or if it's a ring, this is the side bin ring. Or if it's the necklace or the bracelet or anything that's imprintable, again, you want to erase that item. So you just place the item in the middle of the screen and you click erase. And then you click start. And you can see the fractal amplifier displaying here the process of erasing the frequencies from that that item so next i'm going to actually go through i'm going to skip custom playlists until the end so each individual category has frequencies and you can have uh, with this particular category of quantum reach you have the option of scanning which is a beautiful thing to see which frequency you may need at the time. And it only takes a few seconds to do that. And in this case, this person who is who I called sample client, he or it, <laughs> um, the frequencies that were suggested for him after the scan was coordination. Now with that frequency, you could either imprint it again on an imprintable item you see the fractal amplifier here. So you would place the Cephi dot or a ring or whatever in principle item you have, and you can imprint by clicking right here, imprint, and it will do just that. It'll imprint the frequencies onto that item. You also have, oh, there you go. You hear it imprinting. Okay. We also have the option of doing a two minute broadcast. So you can just press play and it would broadcast those frequencies to the target. Remember, this is where it's important to make sure that the target right here is who you'd like to target. So in this case, the target is a sample client. 
Um, this target might also be a pet that you can have categorized in that client profile. So you just wanna make sure the target is there. So you can do a two minute broadcast. You can also do a continuous broadcast. So typically a two minute broadcast or a continuous broadcast would just depend on each case. I find um, with headaches, something like a two minute broad broadcast would be sufficient. The headache usually subsides. Again, each case is completely different. Um, continuous broadcast, again, depending on the situation can be up to maybe four hours, five hours, um, even overnight. But then you wanna stop and give the body a break throughout the day, or uh, if you do it overnight, give the body a little bit of a uh, break you know, throughout the day, or if you do a broad continuous broadcast during the day, you know, just for a couple hours, if need be, depending on the case and the concern, then you want to give the body a break um, overnight. So giving the body a little a moment to adjust is key. So then the body will adjust to the uh, frequencies and it'll help it to optimize, it, optimize the body. So then if we go back, that was the quantum reach category quantum frequency category. Now this category does not only have a scanning um, a, a, a component, but the amount of frequencies that are given to you are phenomenal, absolutely fantastic. And I do suggest going through these because there'll be frequencies in here that you may not even realize that, that you have access to. Um, something for instance like, Chicken pox, colon pain, colon information, inflammation, ears, dysentery, drug addiction, um, eyes, food poisoning, foot blisters. I mean, the number of frequencies that you have access to is awesome. So just take the time to go through it. Neuropathy, pain, pleurisy, pinworms, psoriasis, literally A to Z, fingles, spongy gums, things that you may not have even thought of. Taste, no taste, uh, bad taste, thyroid issues, toothaches, whiplash, worms, ulcers in the mouth, et cetera. So all of those frequencies you have access to, and once again, you see the fractal amp amplifier, so you're able to imprint and or erase the frequencies onto a, an imprintable item. You also, once again, have the opportunity to do a two minute or a continuous broadcast. So that's a great, great category there, quantum frequency. And there's quantum affirmations. Now here you do have the option to scan to see which one you need specifically. And what it takes only a couple seconds. In this case, antibiotics came up. You have your fractal and amplify it to once again, imprint frequencies. You can do the same thing. Imprint, erase, two minute broadcast or continuous frequency. Mind you on an imprintable item, you can imprint several frequencies. So feel free to put a few on there. That's no worries. Next, we have quantum affirmations. Again, you can scan and you can imprint, erase, broadcast the frequencies in that category. Next category, quantum flowers. Now these are all the Bach flower um, remedy, the frequencies to those. You may not know which flower you need. So you can scan and see which Bach flower essence remedy is suggested for you and you can imprint that in an imprintable item. The nice thing about it is it'll not only share with you the flower that's suggested, but also the emotion. Um, you also can educate yourself on what that's for. And when you read it, you're like, yeah, you know what? That does sound like it's beneficial for me. That's the one. So it's nice that they give the descriptions along with the scan on that category, the flower essence category. Then we have quantum chakras. Chakras are a scientific thing. It's not woo woo, it actually, chakras are actually a part of the body, how we were made. And I do have a um, whole video on YouTube if you like to learn more about that. It's an extension of the nervous system and endocrine system. 
you can scan and see which chakra is Ada needing some support. And once again, you can imprint the frequencies inside of the imprintable item and broadcast it to, uh, or, or you, you can imprint or broadcast to the body. Then you have the quantum homeopathics. Now, homeopathics is a phenomenal, phenomenal study. And there are homeopathic physicians, um, practitioners. If you don't have a clue as to what homeopathic you need, you can always, like Lauren mentioned in his video, click by symptom. And when you put in the symptom, you either have the, the, it's not a microscope. Um, oh my goodness, long day. But anyways, I know that's not a microscope and I can't think of the words on the tip of my tongue. But anyways, this icon here is where it's a drop down, So you can alphabetically find the symptoms that you're needing or you click on it, magnifying glass, there we go. And you, if you click on it, then you have this icon pop up and it actually will help you because you can type in the symptom that you're looking for. So say if it's something to do with sinus, right now sinus issues are really going around, you can, it'll direct you to the specific sinus topics and you can click one that might apply like sinusitis. It'll share with you all the different homeopathic remedies that would support your body fighting sinusitis. If you, then you can scan to see which ones are optimal for you specifically. Again, it only takes a few seconds. That's the beauty of this technology. Once you scan and see what your body needs, then you have the opportunity to, once again, imprint these frequencies in an imprintable item. You can do a two minute broadcast or a continuous broadcast. Now, if you notice, this gives you the option of individual or simultaneous. If you click individual, then when you're broadcasting these frequencies, they will broadcast them to the target individually, one after another, after another. And in this case, it would be one, and then 10 seconds later, another one, another one, and then individually in that, in that cycle sequence. Now, if you would like to be a little bit more um, aggressive, I guess I would say, then you can click on simultaneous. And simultaneous means that all of these frequencies would be broadcast all in one time to the body. So you have either option, whatever resonates with you. And again, here we go, the broadcasts are down here. And then that's that category with homeopathics. Then they have the energy homeo energetics category. Now, this is a wonderful, wonderful category. It's very specific. It's already pre-made frequency matrices for you. And you would click on the one that might apply, like let's say bacteria detox. And again, you can imprint that frequency matrix in uh, an imprintable item. And you also have the option of broadcasting that also to the target, okay? So as you can see, Oh, and then there's one more section. Let me just see if I can put my Zoom menu down. The Cephi dots, of course, the Cephi dots. So the Cephi dots, once again, it's nice because you can scan. You scan to see which one resonates with the body at the moment. And in this case, sleep would support this target, this person's body. So the nice thing is not only does it allow you to scan, it shares with you which one you need, but it also tells you some suggestions as to where to place the, the Cephi dot once you've imprinted the frequencies onto it, okay? Here's the fractal amplifier, so you can imprint. And here's where you have the option of erasing or imprinting that Cephi dot in this case. Um, Cephi dots, typically they are not reusable because on the back, that foil tends to get, uh, you know, damaged a little bit, maybe a little rub off or what have you. If it's not, if it's fine, when you take it off after 72 hours, you can use it for 72 hours, then you can erase and re-imprint. But if you see a little, little corner off, 
just throw it out and start fresh. And in a box, there's a box that the box of Cephes that you get has 60 of them. So there's plenty to use. Okay. Okay. So let's see here. Awesome tools within that Cephe. Now, last but not least, this actually is my personal favorite, creating custom playlists. It's my favorite because you have so many different um, options to choose in each category. But wouldn't it be nice to be able to combine all of these into one playlist, especially to be able to pre-make that playlist? That's what this is all about. So this is my personal favorite part of Cephe is creating the playlist. So you have all these frequencies that you need for the category um, all pre-made. It's wonderful. So let's go through what, how to do this. Simple. You're going to click my custom playlist plus sign and create a name. Maybe the name would be right now, and I always say keep it positive. Like if you have sinus issues, we'll put sinus and clear. Okay, or sinus be gone or something that's very positive. Once you have the playlist name, then you can just start exploring in each category, anything that would apply to your sinuses being clear. For instance, quantum reach. And mind you, the more you're using your Cephi categories, the more you're gonna remember what each category has inside of them. And it'll become faster and faster for you to find things. But anything to do with sinus, so I'm looking in the first category, maybe some immune support. I like that one. Uh, let's see if there's anything else, not anything that I can, oh, breathe free. We need to breathe, right? So that might be a good one. And then I'm gonna click on the category title quantum reach to close it out. Next, I'm gonna go to quantum frequency and just scroll all the way down to anything that has to do with sinuses, maybe even S. We have sinus disorders, sinus pressure, sinusitis. So I'm gonna click on all three. Because anytime you have sinus issues, there's a disorder going on. There's sinus pressure, uh, sinusitis, you wanna prevent you know, inflammation and irritation and infection. So we can click on those. Then we sc I scroll back up, click on the category name, then go to the next one, quantum affirmations. Let's see if there's anything that might contribute to, let's see, common cold here. And I think that's pretty much for the sake of demonstration, all that I would put. Uh, I see immune support. Now you only have 15 frequencies that you can apply per playlist. Okay. I already have immune support in there. So I'm going to, I skipped immune support. Um, let's see, then quantum flowers. Now, again, I don't know what all these quantum flowers are for. So if you want to incorporate quantum flowers in your custom playlist, then I would suggest before you create your playlist, I would suggest going into quantum flowers uh before you actually create your playlist and do that scan write down the quantum flower that you need and then you can add it to your custom playlist uh, at that time uh, then we have the quantum chakra again you may not know which chakra needs to have, give you support for the sinuses so before you do your custom playlist you might want to go into quantum chakra do a scan and write down which chakra is suggested for you Quantum homeopathics. Now this again is where you don't know these homeopathic remedies or you may not know the homeopathic remedies. So before you do a custom scan, I would write down the homeopathic remedies that are suggested for you. Or you could even take a quick picture with your cell phone so that you don't have to write them all down, but you can refer back to them in the picture. Some homeopathic remedies are no sodes or cell salts. So if you originally are looking for a homeopathic remedy under quantum homeopathics and don't find it, then it's most likely a no-sode or a cell salt, and you can find it in those categories. 
Then you have the energy homeopathic energetics category again. Let's see if there's anything that applies in this example of sinuses. Let's see, we might want to do anything I'm gonna do with the immune system. Maybe something's in the air. Let's see, maybe a little, maybe it's a virus. Let's see, that would be a good one. Sinus plus allergy would be one I would think to, 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 do, to be a good one. And maybe there's a little bit of mold or fungus in the air. Let's see if there's anything else that I can see here. And I think that's a pretty much, oh, might be a bacteria, the sinus tissue as well. So that there, I think are, that's a good playlist, I think for the sinuses. And then once you have them all in there, you can save it. And once again, you have the option of imprinting these, frequencies on an imprintable item. Now, please note, if you decide to imprint in the Cephi category here, the playlist, you will not see a fractal amplifier displayed to let you know that it's imprinting. So all you need to do though is still place your imprintable item right in the center of the screen, and then you click 20 second imprint, and if it's imprinting, I suggest doing a simultaneous imprint so it's quicker. Imprinting. Not a very pleasant sound. Stop that. There you go. Okay. So you'll know that it's imprinting. You'll hear it imprinting. Just make sure you place the imprintable item in the center of the screen. Okay, perfect. Or the other option would be to do a 20, a two-minute broadcast or a continuous broadcast as well. So you have all those beautiful options when you're doing your playlist. Now, a little note, please, to remember, when you're in the category of Cephi, you do not have to listen to those frequencies, okay? And when you heard them, even with the imprinting, they don't sound amazing. So you don't have to listen to them. You can actually broadcast frequencies from Cephi and it's not something that you have to listen to. The modules that you need to listen to in order to get the benefit are when you do your easy scan because step one is your inner voice scan. And once you do your inner voice scan and you get your report, that's when you will listen to your tones, whether it's the pulse tone or the classic tones. So you would listen to those tones that are from your inner voice report in the easy scan or directly from your inner voice scan and report. You would listen to these tones here, okay? Okay, very good. So I think I covered it all. Uh, let's see if there's anything else in here. I did quantum playlists. I did all the different modules and then the Cephi dots. And so, yeah, that's all about Cephi. If anyone has any specific questions, you know, I'm here to answer. Feel free to connect with me on WhatsApp or um, or Facebook, Solex Facebook or whatever works. I'm fine. I, I, with, I'm, it's fine with me. Just go ahead and connect and we can chat about it more. Okay. All righty. Stay well, my friends.